Before the video starts, I just want to say, holy crap dogs. Thank y'all so much for way surpassing 100 subs. I think I got like over 250 subs from last video and I was just shocked by what you guys did. Thank y'all so much. Anyways, back to the video. Any woogers, in my last post, I asked you what do you want me to add to a game, and I got a ton of responses, some bad and some good. And I've heard of these game swaps people were doing, and I've always been wanting to do them, but I wanted to try with these comments I collected. I got with six devs to make your comments. There's only one rule, one item from Toolbox. Yup, that's it. And let me say, the game was very, very concerning. Watch to see what happens. Alright, so Super Tommy Gamer, you are going to have to create a Subway's Surfers animation at the bottom of your screen. Wow. Uh, <laughs> yeah, that's, a, that's incredible. Here, I'm gonna make a set a timer. So, one hour timer right here, and it starts in three, two, one start i'm gonna check back at th around 30 minutes and yeah let's see how that subway surfers animation is gonna be all right you have 25 minutes left can i test out the game and it won't break um i'm gonna do a final check and see okay you got a script okay Oh, we c I forgot uh, about like the cool little typing thing. We could both type on the script, so I can just go like this. So it kind of works. Alright, I'm gonna test out the game and see if it works. Let's say this. Uh, is it working? Oh! It's Thomas! Oh, wow. Yeah. Did they, um... I'll just let you do that. I, I'll, I'll let you test it out. I don't know. I don't know what's going on. Oh, wow. I saw that train thing. Yeah, it's Thomas. So, there was supposed to be an animation for the little dummy guy, but it doesn't work the viewport frames, and I didn't have enough time to <laughs> fix it, so that's how I got an hour. For, for uh, like, Subway Surfers at the bottom of the screen, that's, like, better than I expected. Yeah. Like, when I saw the comment, I was just like, oh, gosh. But, like, yes, hey, not bad, not bad, not bad. I like it. Thanks. All right, now we're on to the next person. All right, next up, we got Wallen, also known as GL underscore 5Y. Um, but, yeah, uh, what happened to the base plate? I think the other developer destroyed the base plate. I mean, the spawn location but anyways so what you're going to have to create is grandoff saying you shall not pass um randomly in the game you have one hour to make um uh, your thing that i gave you the gandalf three two one go well the challenges begin let's see what you can create a few moments later. Shut up! Alright, you have 30 minutes left. So I can see you got kind of like this. Pretty cool. Alright, right, well you're halfway through. Only 30 minutes left. Right. Alright, well I'll see you in, another, in like when there's 5 minutes left. Right. Yeah. All right, your timer's done. Uh, how did you do? Let's see, you got like the Grandolf here. Let's let's see how this goes. All right, let's see. <laughs> oh, that's so good. Uh, all right, well, I guess next developer. Next up, we got Zizzy Craft R. What's up, Zizzy? <laughs> Slay Queen, what's up? Okay, buddy. Um, so what you're going to have to do is make a jumping boat. Bro, that is the stupidest prompt ever. <laughs> yeah, make a jumping boat. So, yeah, we'll see what you make. You're turning into screw if you're making your viewers do work for you. Uh, yeah, but at least, hey, at least I don't hire miners, alright? <laughs> Anyways, uh... <laughs> Alright, I'll see you in an hour. Starting in three, 
two, one. All right. Wait, peace. Few inches later. Dude, so wait, you're done? Yeah, I'm done. Dude, there's no way you're done. And there's 46 minutes left, bro. I hasn't know. Even, like... Hasn't even been 15 minutes, bro. I, I, I bro. Oh my. <laughs> what is this? It's a jumping boat, bro. That looks, that looks like half a chicken, bro. <laughs> it's a boat with legs, dumbass. Bro, what the heck, bro? What is this pitchfork, bro? <laughs> oh my gosh, dude, I wanna see this. What is this sound effects? <laughs> dude, I'm sorry, but it's just. <laughs> Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Holy crap, bro! This is incredible! Thank you. I love this! <laughs> Alright, on to the next. <laughs> uh, on to the next developer. Alright, so next up we got SpongeBob, also known as oh. Another One Plus One. Um, so, yeah, don't don't mind anything with, uh, coming from this game. So, what you're going to have to do is you're going to have to make a slime blob that leaves a green trail when it walks by. Uh, should it, like, follow the nearest player or something? Or just... I mean, it's a slime blob. You can do whatever you want. So, you got an hour to okay. do it. Let me set up the timer. Timer starts in three, two, one, go. All right, I'll see you at 30 minutes, and then I'm gonna see you at when there's five minutes left. Uh. Bro, you're already done? Yeah. Dang. Bro, it has a- Why is everyone finishing so quick? Like, it's- there's oh, no. 40- there's 43 minutes left. What the heck, bro? Okay, well, let-, let let's see what happens when I test out the game. <sighs> Oh my god. <laughs> Dude, that's sick! Green slime blob, that's, that's a good job, good job. Alright, well, it's up to the next developer. Later. Next up, we got, uh, Nalum, also known as Phase Caden 10. Uh... Why is this? Uh, don't, don't mind anything in this game right now. Uh... <laughs> So, what did I come into? Uh, uh, so what you're going to be making is a very, very tall obby that's taller than Roblox itself. Excuse me, is that possible? I don't know, we'll see. Can you do okay. it? Okay. Alright, you have an hour to do it. So, alright, your timer starts in three, two, one, go. Well, well good luck. <laughs> Uh, very tall lobby. Eventually. Alright, I just wanted to let you know, Nalam, that you have your 15 minutes in. 15 minutes in? Holy crap, bro, this is so tall. It's not. Oh my gosh, you can't even see base plate up here. Yeah, like, Dude. I tried to make it so you can't see the base plate. Oh my gosh, what if you fall? If you fall, you fall to base play, right? Yeah. Dang, bro, it's so freaking tall. I could barely see the base play. <laughs> the actual flip. Oh my gosh, I see base plate. Later. All right, boy, I'm mucho Mike. K two X. Hi, I'd like to say that you are halfway through the challenge. There's an easy and hard. Hard doesn't even yeah. look that hard. Oh, it really is when you do it. Because I've added some parts which is like, if you stand on it, you fall through it, then you fall right to the base plate. Alright, I'm gonna play test the game. See what you got halfway through the challenge. Oh. Holy crap. Shoot, I fell. What um, the heck? Okay, so- Toti is not spawned. You're crazy. Okay. Okay, and then a hard- Okay, buddy. That hard is... Rigged. Alright, well, yeah, that's halfway. 328. 
a.m. All right, dude, unmute your mic now. Hello. Hello there, my name is Astro. I've been scripting on Roblox for close to four years, and today I am forced to participate in this one-hour scripting challenge. My task is to create a survey that teleports a player to a game, depending on their answers. I started off by making the survey UI. This proved to be one of the easier tasks in the challenge, so I was able to get it done pretty quickly. To be fair, it did end up looking pretty bland in the end, but this challenge is more about functionality than looks, so it doesn't really matter. Hopefully it's good enough for Trix to release my family from his basement. Next up, I started scripting the survey itself. I did this by making a for loop that goes through a table containing the survey's questions and used the template I made earlier for each question. This allows me to collect the player's answer in a text box and adjust the survey's results accordingly. Now if that bored you as much as it bored me, here's a pretty boring scripting time-lapse. Here, unmute your mic. Unmute your mic. Yeah. All right. It's over. I like. Is it over? Uh, yes. Your time is up. Oh my god. No, no, I'm just kidding. No, you're halfway there. All right, all right. Um. Yeah. Dude, I don't know if I can do this, bro. This. Come on, man. Here, I'll give you a tip. Just go to games on Roblox and just copy their link, and then just pop up the link. And then the they could type it in if they want. Oh, okay, okay, I get what you mean. All they right, can right. type in the link. They can type in the link in Google if they want. But yeah. All right, man, I'm gonna try. Do what you want. I mean, if you <laughs> can't do it. That's that's pretty bad for you. That sucks. That's embarrassing <laughs> for you on my video. No, it's over. It's over. Come on, bro. It can't be over. Try at least try. At least try. I know you're lazy and you want to go to bed, but at least try. Alright, alright. I decided to base this survey on four different categories. War, Obby, Adventure, and Shooter. So I gathered a bunch of games and stored their IDs in their corresponding category in a table. With this method, I can teleport the player to a random game, depending on their answers. To finish everything up, I added a couple more questions to the survey, so I would have more information on what game to teleport a player to. Your game. My game, mm. yeah. Mm. Yes. Yeah, no, I mean, obvious. No. Yes. Yes. No. 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 Yes. Let me see uh, what game. Up. Oh, I got to 3008. I went to 3008. Bro, your survey is actually wildly good. I thought this thing was gonna be terrible. No, it's actually really good. Like, it. Like, it, it actually. Good job, bro. You know? Thank you, man. One Dude, hour is gonna... crazy. The one time in Roblox history that people might actually play games that stupid Roblox developers on YouTube make. Dude, if you, uh, if you want to, like, have this game be played, you should probably, like, change things around the map, remove the little Subway <laughs> Surfers thing. <laughs> no, the Subway <laughs> Surfers is amazing. That's sad, bro. I thought I could play Subway Surfers. If you're like these goobers right here and you want to collaborate with me in a video, well, it's actually pretty easy. It's just by joining my Discord server down below where there's a ton of people that I can collect to collaborate. And don't worry, there's always room for more. And if you like my content, then be sure to subscribe, where you can be the first to watch my new vid- Uh... Anyways, yeah, you should definitely subscribe. As always, I'm Trix. And I'll see ya whenever I see ya. Ah! Ah!